Carter, and welcome to the exciting world of hip. Good morning. I'm Andrea Jackson with your wake-up call for Thursday, December 23rd, 2010. Merry Christmas from China, where 20,000 prehistoric fossils lay nestled in mountain beds waiting to be counted and cataloged after staying covered up for 200 million odd years. Congress wrapped up its season, or session for all you fancy DC types, by agreeing to fund $4.2 billion for the 9-11 responders dealing with health problems related to their cleanup work at Ground Zero. It's Thursday, and that means it's time for the study of the week. Strap yourselves in for this one. Obese people are more likely to die in car wrecks than their less obese counterparts. Automakers will start looking at new ways to redesign cars for the large Marge set. Regardless of what you thought of him as a president, George W. Bush has some serious draw as a writer. His autobio, Decision Points, has sold 2 million copies since its November debut. Coach Larry Brown is done with the Charlotte Bobcats, so says team owner Michael Jordan, after a less than stellar start to the season. And Spider-Man, the most expensive and cursed show on Broadway, will be back open for business tonight after one too many on-set accidents. The last one sent a stunt double falling 30 feet into a stage pit after his safety harness bailed mid-air on Monday. Your San Diego forecast, partly cloudy, highs in the 60s. That is your Thursday morning wake-up call. I'm Andrea Jackson. I will ring you in the morning. Be good.